Proper care for your Allen Edmonds, including our classic strand and walnut, begins by removing dirt and residue from the upper using a cotton flannel cloth. This helps to prepare the natural calfskin and also prevents any abrasion from occurring during that process. You can apply some of Allen Edmonds Conditioner Cleaner, wiping it in the area of concentrated dirt. This removes the dirt and this material also dries relatively quickly so that you can move on to the polishing process. Allen Edmonds Premium Shoe Polish is specially formulated to color match each of our different colors of calfskin. In this case, we're gonna use our Walnut Premium Polish. This is applied by simply squeezing on the tube and then use the self-applicating sponge to thoroughly and completely cover the upper with polish. Don't be concerned at this point about excess polish building up in the pinks or perfing detail on the upper, as it will demonstrate later how to remove that. This material dries relatively quickly, so we can begin the buffing process. First, we'll remove those excess areas of polish. The stencil dauber has horsehair, another natural material, so that you do not have any abrasive action occurring. The same stencil dauber can be run along the weld line of the shoe, removing any excess polish or dirt that might be built up. Now we're ready to begin the buffing process. Again, using your cotton flannel cloth, wipe the premium polish from the upper. Because the calfskin is a natural material, there is a fiber content that remains present even after the shoes have been handcrafted. To achieve a higher sheen, we're gonna use our horsehair brush and actually raise that fiber. This will allow us to make a final pass with our cotton flannel cloth and achieve an even higher shine. Lastly, we'll apply the heel and sole edge dressing to the weld and heel base. This restores color and serves as a protectant. This material will dry naturally on its own or excess can be removed using a cotton flannel cloth. And at this point, your strands are ready for the next board meeting.